In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to effectively manage and set up your GitHub repository for publishing with GitHub pages. Whether you're a seasoned developer or just getting started, this guide will walk you through the essential steps to make your project accessible to the world. Let's dive in and streamline the process. To begin, you'll want to navigate to GitHub, open your web browser, and type in GitHub's URL, pressing Enter to reach the GitHub homepage. If you haven't already, log into your account using your credentials. Being logged in is essential as this will allow you to manage your repositories. Once you're on the GitHub homepage and logged in, it's time to focus on your profile. You'll find an icon or image in the corner representing your profile. Click on it and a drop-down menu will appear. From this menu, select your repositories. After clicking on your repositories, you'll be greeted with a list of all the projects you've been working on. Locate the specific repository you wish to work with and click on it. This action will bring you to your repository's main overview page, where you manage your project's essential aspects. From here, you'll want to direct your attention to the top of the page where you'll find several tabs like code, issues, and so on, but for our purposes, click on the settings tab. Once you're in the settings of your repository, there are many options, but the next step is crucial for setting up your GitHub pages. Scroll down until you see the Pages section in the sidebar. Click on it to configure your GitHub Pages settings. Here you will see the Source or Branch section. This area determines where GitHub Pages will build your project from. Make sure that this is set to Main or your default branch, ensuring that GitHub Pages knows which part of your repository you want it to publish. And just like that, you're done with this setup. Once you've verified that the branch is set to Main, GitHub Pages will start processing your request. It can take a few minutes for the changes to propagate, so be patient. Once the processing is complete, your site will be live and accessible via the URL provided by GitHub Pages, usually in the format of username.github.io slash repository name. If you encounter issues along the way, double check each step. Ensure that you're logged in, accessing the correct repository, and have the correct permissions. If your branch isn't main, remember to change it accordingly. Revisiting each step with precision can remedy most issues. And there you have it, a straightforward way to take your project live with GitHub pages. I hope this guide has been helpful.